Finding something for the kids to do on Halloween night isn't a problem. Keeping them safe that night is another issue. I spoke with Mark Alba of the Council Bluffs Police Department and he says the kids should take it slow. Don't run, walk. Stay on the sidewalks and obey the traffic rules. And stay in neighborhoods that are familiar to you. Carry a flashlight and wear clothes that have reflective marks so drivers can see you. Only carry flexible plastic props. Never carry real knives, swords, or other weapons. And only stop at houses that are well lit. Parents, go over the safety rules with your child. Make sure they know how to cross the street properly and know how to react around strangers. Make sure your child knows how to get in contact with you as well. Send them with a cell phone if possible. And of course, know where your child will be trick-or-treating. And although tampering is rare, check all the candy when they get home. And if anything looks suspicious, toss it out just to be safe. And homeowners, make sure your yard and pathway to your front door is well lit and clear of obstructions, such as ladders, hoses, sprinklers, and etc. And use battery-powered candles to light up those pumpkins. It's much safer.